little wombles how are you doing I hope you're all well it's hump day yes it's nearly half 11 I've been up for about an hour and a half uh, better move this chicken out of the sunlight not good defusting the chicken for, for tea for me and Denise anyway but Georgia can't have it or we think she won't be able to have it because she's going to get some teeth extracted today I was going to say yanked out, but that sounds a bit vicious. Uh, yeah, she's got a couple of teeth taken out today, so she might not be able to have much. So I'm going to make sure they've got soup in and things like that for her, just in case. Uh, yeah, busy getting washing done, getting caught up on the on the washing. Uh, need to get some hoovering done. Probably probably need to untangle the hoover because it's just full of hair yet again. Uh, these dice and animals. Oh my god. Not so much picking up the cat hair, but the girl's long hair just wrapped around the uh, the bushes. And it just bungs it up, it does. Yeah, just seen be watching Alan Sharkey's videos. He's got himself a new GoPro and a new Apple Mac. 27 inch retina. He, he makes it known. Yes, but it's brilliant to see you back, Alan. Um, so pleased to see you back, and it's good to see you smiling as well. Uh, it's been such a long time since uh, since we've seen any videos from yourself. So it's good to see you again, and glad things are working out. And you you've moved in permanently with the Denise, so he has, <laughs> um, and the budgies, the budgets. Yes. But yeah, um, I better get on with some of the, the chores that I've got and I'll catch you guys a bit later. Check this out. <laughs> Just from that thing there, there we are, there, the Hoover head, from the Dyson, I've got all this. <laughs> it's like a <laughs> there it is. Disgusting. Yes. It's what happens when you've got girls in the house. Although I do wish Dyson would design something that didn't clog up. Great picking it up, but I don't want to jam in the hoover up every two seconds. Uh, now on to the second head, the smaller head. That needs doing as well. Hopefully you can see that. That's come out of the small hoover head. And a lot of it's long grey hair. Hmm, I wonder who that can be. Dennis! <clears throat> <sighs> Bloody knackered now. That's the house hoover and the stairs and bedrooms and bathroom and all that. And I still had to unclog loads more hair after it. Even after just doing the house once. Bloody knackered. Uh, just put new batteries in the bin as well. <clears throat> Got one of the Morphe Richards bins, it's an automatic one. Brilliant bin. Uh, and the batteries have actually lasted a lot longer than what I was expecting. So it's not surprising they've run out. So just replace them, it's working a dream now. So, hmm. Well, we're home. Just tap to focus. Yes, I picked George up from school. He was very nervous. Here she is. Hello. How are you? Oh, I don't want to smile. She's had two teeth taken out and she feels like she's had Botox. Uh, why is the camera flipped? See, the, the slippery fox ran over the the snowy, sunsidey hill. The what? <laughs> <laughs> 
How are you feeling? Uh, I don't want to smile. <laughs> you don't want to smile? Because I've got a weird smile. You've got a weird smile because of, of the injections? I feel like I've had Botox. Mm -hmm. But how are you feeling apart from that? Are you in pain? Or? No, just this, 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 yeah. You know, when you have, uh, like, you've been sitting on your foot too long and you get like a little yeah. tingle in your foot. Mm -hmm. If you go like that, that's what it feels like in, in your side of your mouth. Yeah. Mm. And every time I speak after all, <laughs> hmm. Was it as bad as what you were expecting? No. You're doing very well. I'm dead proud of you. Well done. Mm. <laughs> what was it? The slippery... Slippery fox. The slippery fox. Slid down the sunny slope. The slippery know. fox slipped slid down the slip. I don't know. I'm just, made, I'm just making it up. <laughs> Try. The sly fox slid down the, the sunny side of the slope. The what? The, 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 the sly, the sly fox, fox slid down, down the, the sunny slip. side of the slope. The sly fox slid down the sunny side of the slope. <laughs> <laughs> you sound drunk. The sly fox slid, slid down the sunny side of the slope. <laughs> Sausages. <laughs> Sausages. <laughs> smile. <laughs> the smile is the other mother's legs. You look like I'm, you, they don't look any different. They probably just look worse than what they are. What's the way they smile at me? The sly fox sit down the slippery side of the sunny slope. Yes. <laughs> Dead proud of her. Dead proud of her. Oh, she's, she's done very well. I was sitting there going, like that, because like, when he was like trying to get the tooth out, her whole head was moving like that. It's like, oh, didn't want to see it. But she's done very, very well. I'm really proud of her because she, she was really nervous before she went in. Uh, next thing is when that's healed up, she's got an appointment either 5th or 6th of January to be assessed to get a brace because um, this is a thing that we'll be waiting for for like seven or eight years now getting this brace so now the teeth these two teeth are out you can uh, start what's the matter? back in a minute hey 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 Denise's on her way home, she's just need a nip for some chips. Because I asked her earlier, what happened with the chicken? She says, chips, but we need these, and give us a list of other stuff. So I got the other stuff, got home, didn't have any chips. She says, well, I put it in the list, but no, you didn't. You said, well, having chips, but you didn't say that's one of the things that I needed to get. So she's having to get some chips. Hmm. And the chicken's cooking away here, in the Go Chef 18 one. Fantastic little thing it is. Um, done the dishes, I'm on to my third or fourth load of washing, which is washed, it's now in the dryer. I've uh, just had another marketing call from some unsolicited company, which I've blocked, but I've gone and set up a petition on the government's website, because I'm pig sick of them. And there's been petitions in the past, uh, even newspapers have tried to get these banned, and it, it just keeps getting shelved. You know, just keeps getting shelved under there by the government or archived as, the, as their website says. Hmm. They need to get it stopped. It does my head in. Seriously, and I'm sure it does other people's heads in. What I'll do, um, I'll actually put a link. I need five people. I've emailed a few of my friends. I've already got one signature so far. I need five people. But anybody in the UK who watches this, Please go below, sign the petition, um, I'll put the link down below and share the petition with your friends and let's see how many people I can get, um, get on this petition. Um, I'm sure, I can't remember how many it is but there's so many and the government's got to do something or whatever, let's see. Uh, Ideally, what I would like is if these companies banned from making PPI calls, whether they're UK companies or international companies, because sometimes they come from international and, you know, they're, they're harder to block. But 
but also I want the mobile phone companies and the home phone companies to be made to provide a way to block these because they can they know the numbers that's being used like if you ring a telephone number they know how much it is they, they recognize the number that's building which have a way for that number so what's to stop them doing it in reverse recognizing the number that's trying to come through to one of their phones and their systems just so they block it before it reaches that phone what's to stop them doing that you know multi-million pound or billion pound companies surely to god you can flip and sort something like that out but please sign the petition below share it amongst all your friends get them to sign it and share it and let's get this thing out there and let's make this living government do something it would be nice let's see what the power of youtube facebook google plus full screen maker studios all that you know all the people in the uk let's get this government to pull their fingers out <sighs> rant over <laughs> yes i'm just waiting for Denise coming she shouldn't be too long uh little georgia there watching her telly how are you feeling she's had some tomato soup and had her bread soaked in it i will get you some paracetamol then you can have some before you go to bed as well No, no, it's full of sugar. You don't want that getting in the oven wounds. Sorry, I pressed the button on the side of the phone to connect to the to my home network and cut it off. <laughs> Georgia's one nice cream. I'll have to read the leaflet and see if she's actually allowed any, but it's only six o'clock. Mm. Um, yeah, I'll have to check up because I, I don't know if sugar's allowed, because um, ice cream's allowed because I love sugar in it. You don't want that getting in the wounds where the teeth have been pulled out. I don't know. I need to check it out. Mm -hmm. Oh, somebody's not happy. She's not happy. Where's she gone? Where's she? One in there. She's not hungry. She just wants something to eat. She's had tomato soup and bread. But she's not hungry. She just wants something proper to eat. But she can't. We've exchanged. She's had an operation on her mouth. Perfect sphere. Uh, Are you alright, Debbie? You call for me. Thank you. Not a happy cookie. In the middle of watching. In the side of 30. Nice flattering picture. There you go, Claire. Mm. <laughs> and. Bosky's here. There you go. Focus. Hello. How's it, Debbie? Oh, it's my face, look really bad. It is on this, yeah, I might need to change the sense. It is quite warm here. How's it, Debbie? What? Don't be sad about the bag. Mm. A little bit stressed would be the word I would use. To, mm. the, to the point where I thought, well, I hope there's a nice bottle of wine in the fridge. But I haven't. Because I'm a good girl. <laughs> There's some beer in there. I think. <laughs> oh, well, there's a few bottles of beer. There's that sombrero or whatever that Stu likes. And your Carlsberg's there. Look what I found. <laughs> you're blurred. There you go. Yeah, you're focused. Yeah, so you're glad to be home then? Yeah. Please. Do you want to your bath? Nope. Hey. Okay, dokie. Alright. I'm going to keep the camera on you now. Okay. Not too close. <laughs> <laughs> yes, yeah, so I'm going to finish off having a cup of, uh, cup of tea, my Pepsi. Uh, finish watching Claire's vlog. Oh, the fishies. Not fed. Oh, the fishies have been fed. <laughs> Can't see any blood worms? Oh, yes, I can see them. They're hanging off the trees, like Christmas decorations, yeah. Uh, so, yeah. 
<coughs> That's been done. George was waiting in the freezer for some ice cream because she's allowed that. Um, we need to get the dishes done and settle down. But I am a celebrity. And then maybe it's the last episode of season two of the following, if you can stay awake. Says me, who keeps like, like this, watching it come. <laughs> That's been me the last few times. <laughs> uh, yeah, uh, then work tomorrow. Uh, oh, Saturday. It's the day we're going to see Steve's band, isn't it? Yeah, we're going to see my, my friend's band. Uh, the band I could have been in if I, if I was able to still do the travelling to go and do the practice and everything but me back went and I couldn't go down and it's like an hour's drive from here and an hour's drive back and it's just too far so I'm gonna go down show support and it's all soul music and blues and stuff like that that they do so yeah I'll try and get a bit of footage it might be good but yes I'll get going for the moment um, don't know if that's it for the night but we'll soon find out do us for now. She waves. Can you help me with that, Sam? <laughs> Silly girl. What are you like? Cup of tea. <laughs> yes. It's a cup of tea time, so it is. With extended opening hours, come and play even longer this Christmas at Into Metro Central. Hey, Clancy. Your teeth look like they're all over the place on this. No. Yeah, anyway, cup of tea. I'm at celebrities over. Uh, cup of tea, then go upstairs to watch the following. The last episode of season two. It's getting good. See if Denise can stay awake. Good. Thanks for popping by on this hump day. Um, can you do us a favour? Explain what hump day means. The middle of the week. Over the hump. It's all downhill from here. So Shara, Shara it was saying to me, oh why does your dad say hum day? She went, I never get why he says hum day, but it's like the middle of the week and you go over the hill or something. Yeah, over the hump, it's all downhill. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. There you go. So I'll get going. And thanks so much for popping by. Uh, I really appreciate it. I appreciate everybody's support. So, uh, yeah, I'll catch you all very soon and take care, everybody. And lots of love from us.